Gurn sustained his single-minded dedication to the series right up until the last day of location shooting in Port Merion. Much to the frustration of the crew, as Beryl Booth recalls. Yes, well, we thought this is the last day and we'll be wrapping soon and, and getting ready to leave Port Merion in the morning. And there really wasn't very much left to shoot. We didn't think that there was anything that we could possibly cover that hadn't been covered. But Pat had other ideas and he just uh, made the crew use a handheld camera and rush about all over Port Merion at different spots of, of the location. And he'd think up shots as he went along and none of us knew what he was doing because he, I mean, they just came out of his head like that. And we were rushing up upstairs and downstairs and, and uh, across, you know, right across Port Merriam from one villa to another and doing shots outside, outside some of the cottages and through the grounds and, and they, were, they were rather meaningless shots, all of Pat on the move because he always seemed to be on the move and, um, and the crew got really very tired of this in the end because they were humping the equipment all over the place and I was wondering how on earth I was going to explain all these shots to the editor, what they, were, what they meant and where they were going to go. We just gave up in the end. We just shot, shot the stuff and, um, and rather left it to them to sort out afterwards. I mean, they had so much material to choose from. <laughs> but uh, we were exhausted then at the end of the day. And, and when he finally said rap, everybody was just so relieved we thought well that's the end and we couldn't get away quickly enough